We now learn about logarithms, and in this tutorial our objective is to gain a solid understanding of what a logarithm actually is. Now, here's the idea. Let's say I were to write 2 raised to the power of 3 equals to 8. Well, when I write this, 2 is known as the base, and 3 is known as the exponent. But it's also known as the logarithm. And in fact, it's known as the logarithm of 8 in base 2. In other words, this 3 is the power to which we have to raise 2 in order to get the number 8. And we can write that statement in the following way. Log base 2 of 8 is equal to 3. And here's how to read this expression. First of all, log is short for logarithm, which remember is just another word for exponent or power. The 2 that we see here is the base that we're working with. And what log base 2 of 8 equals to 3 is actually telling us is the power or logarithm to which we need to raise 2 to get 8 is 3. And that's all that this is actually saying. Now, both of these statements are completely equivalent. They're telling us the same thing. And if you understand what we've just seen, then you've already understood what a logarithm actually is. And in fact, we may even be ready to go ahead and calculate a logarithm. For instance, let's say we were asked to find or calculate log base 5 of 25. Well, remembering what we saw with the example above, log base 5 of 25 equals to the power or the logarithm to which we need to raise the base 5 in order to get 25. And it doesn't take us too long to remember that 5 to the power of 2 equals to 25. And so we can state log base 5 of 25 equals to 2. And that's the answer. And we can also write this equality in its exponential form. Indeed, we can write 5 to the power of 2 is equal to 25. Both of these statements are completely equivalent. Now, to finish this tutorial, we're going to write down a more general result or rule. Here it is. If b raised to the power of c equals to a, then log base b of a equals to c. Now, these two statements are completely equivalent and can be read from left to right or from right to left. On the left-hand side, this is known as the exponential form, and on the right-hand side, it's known as the logarithmic form. They're both saying the same thing, though. That is, the power to which we need to raise the base b for it to equal to a is c. And that's it for this tutorial. There we go, everyone. I really hope that helped. And if it did, please hit like on this video and even subscribe to our channel because that really does help us. I'll see you soon.